<laughs> there are... <sighs> <Hmm>. <laughs> so <laughs> and what's making my princess smile like that? <laughs> Eddie, it's just a funny video, it's nothing serious. Mm. You know, I can't help but wonder sometimes, you know, how did I get so lucky to have you? How could? You always say that, Dad. I should be the one thanking you. You've given me anything I could ever ask for. I'm so lucky to have you, Dad. <sighs> You're my pride. My joy. <laughs> Just remember, no matter what happens out there, you deserve nothing but the best. Just be careful who you let into your heart out there. Not everyone is worthy of a princess. Yeah. Hmm? Dad, you mean overprotective again? But don't worry, I've got my eyes wide. Oh my God, that's my girl. <laughs> <laughs> Always stay smart. See, baby, you have all the whole world at your feet. And I will make sure you stay that way. <laughs> <laughs> I know that, I know that. Good. Trust me, I'll let you down. Okay. Yeah, my baby, I love you. Thank I you love so you much. Thank you, my girl. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Love you always. Don't go crazy. So you're still on this assignment, since? Oh my bro. Bro, this assignment is killing me. I just, I'm just messing up my plans to record new songs. Yeah. Come on, this thing. And they are calling musicians now. Do and one. Do and one. Come on, this thing. You know, this thing is not your calling. All this school thing, not be your thing. At the go studio, go make music. Maybe I'm like that, not my talent, no. So I'm going to make you blue. I want to now define the beauty. This one is our thing. You leave this one for the boss. Players boss. Yes, now. Uh uh. And it's even that simple. Guy, no waste your time here, yeah, beggar, beggar, beggar. May I go sing? Go studio, go studio, go I studio. Go but make song. If you fail, <laughs> no, I don't know how to talk to boss. Guy, they doubt me. No, you just doubted me. No, no, no. Do your thing. Boy, sir, be face that one. No. <laughs> uh... Where do I even start from? Tell me my right rubbish. I'm not hearing nothing. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Come look at this. <laughs> Can you believe what you actually wrote? He said, I'm hoping you have a great day. <laughs> <laughs> hoping. Great. This is one trying to send you a love letter, a text message from Nigerian school. Oh, come on. At least it's trying. Besides, who cares about typo and it's so cute. <laughs> cute. Ha. Cute. I'll call it hilariously adorable. You better be careful. Next thing you know, he's texting you in emojis. <laughs> Oh my god, we're late for class. Professor Okereke is going to kill us. Oh my god, that's true. If I late again, we might get expelled. Oh my god. How did, it, how did we get caught up in this again? I thought we had time. Uh, because we were too busy. They dream about Mr. Type and I hurry up, my oh, driver is going to. Hi, Mom, I'm back. Yeah, mom. What was school today? Uh, school was fine. Hmm. So it was there. You're welcome. You're welcome. I got your favorite stew. Oh, you're cooking? Of course, I'm done cooking already. Thank you, mom. <laughs> so, tell me, how is the music coming along? And that you will be a big assignment that you were worried about. Assignment. Assignment is a mess, but. Well, 
got to come out for me. This poor. And my new music. It's coming out. <laughs> I feel like it's going to be a hit. I hope so. Yeah. Brian, you know, you have been working so hard. But don't just let your dream consume you. I understand, man. But you know me so well now. I'm not going to stop till I make something of myself. Brian, you know I've been through a lot in this life. And I don't want you to face the same struggle. I won't. I promise. It's okay. Go to the living room and come in with your food. Come on. Tell me why you're not coming. Bro. Like, I'm in my estate somewhere I didn't even know. I'm waiting for you. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. No problem. Um, I guess I was a bit lost in my own world too. I guess you need to pay attention to where we're going to next time. Fair enough. Or maybe it's a good thing. Some accidents can just happen. So you way of saying you're glad you bumped into me. I think I like this conversation, yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> if you don't mind, can I get your number? That quick. Okay. Only if we mm -hmm. promise our next meeting wouldn't be more of a collision. Uh, I promise not to bug you. Uh. Uh. Okay. See you around me. Wow. Dara. Dara, you have to come to this party. It's going to be epic. Everyone is talking about it. Look. Gigi, we've talked about this. I don't like going to parties. I'd rather stay in my room and relax. Yeah, we go again. Relax. Relax. Relax again. But there are, you know you can spend your college life reading magazines and chilling in your room all day. This is the time for you to come out and have some fun. There are, let's go now. Look, look, look. I don't see the point. And parties aren't my scene. But that's exactly why you should come out. You have to step out of your comfort zone. Plus, cute guys will be there. Just say you want to go because uh, it's guys. not about the cute uh, guys. Cute guys or not, I want to go. I don't feel like going. I have other things I want to do. Wait, other things like what? Other things like what? Stay in your room and watch another episode of your favorite show, right? That's not a bad idea. It's a bad thing. There are. Come on. Okay, think of this as an adventure. When we go there. And you don't like the party? We'll leave there on time. It's always an adventure. I promise. You. Please. Uh, okay. I promise, Dara. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Only if you promise me. I promise, I promise, I that's, promise. It's worth my time. I promise. You will enjoy it. You have a great time. And you meet good people. Are you going? Please. Say yes, say yes, say yes, say yes, say yes. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. You're coming. Mm. You're coming. All right, let me tell them that we're going. Tell me what is your party is about. We're coming. So. My curl is going to be there. Yeah, and that other guy that I said is cute is going to be Mr. there too. Typo? Stop saying Mr. Typo now. <laughs> Mr. Typo, I don't I mean, like Mr. Typo. I want sweet. Mr. Typo is sweet, but <sighs> but then my curl is coming. Yeah. You know, Michael. Bye. So Miss Dara, I heard you've been spending some time with a certain someone. <sighs> Care to spill the tea? Oh God, Chichi, can you leave me alone? I'm trying to focus on this research. Don't tell me you're trying to dodge this question. Because I saw the blush on your face. <laughs> so tell me, who is he? Okay. It's a guy named Brian. In our school. Wait, 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 wait. Brian? Yeah. We're like the Brian in our school. Oh my God, what's he like? Tell me. Okay, Brian is smart. He's kind. Like, he's talented. He has this passion for music. Honestly. Makes me feel so comfortable. There are you in love. 
<sighs> my friend is falling in love. <laughs> and yeah, I was thinking you're not the romantic type. Oh my god, it's like, I know it's unexpected, honestly, but like, Brian makes me feel comfortable and feel like myself better than okay. anyone has. Okay. <sighs> so when is the wedding? So I'll start praying for my bridesmaid dress. Can you stop being dramatic? We're just getting to know each other. But I want to attend the wedding now. Oh my god. Chichi. And you and Brian are the perfect match. Ugh. So, no wedding. Leave me alone. But then I'm happy you're happy. You mm. deserve someone who makes you smile like this. Oh god. Can you stop being dramatic? So I'm being dramatic. <sighs> Calm for down. love. Calm down. When it involves love, ah. I'm always like this because I love love. Oh. And I'm happy my friend is in love. Like you, Mr. Typo. Don't call Mr. Typo. <laughs> Don't call Mr. Typo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Let's but go thanks, Chichi. You're the best. You're welcome. Let's go inside before I start teasing you again. Mm, I know, right? Yeah. <sighs> There's this new movie I want you to watch, Chichi. I want you to watch it more. Can you do it? Hold on. Baby, baby. You did that be so crazy. Try it. I think I'm actually now. I'm worried though. I'm worried. Worried about what? Guys, you and this your Dera girl. I think they disturb me for head. Well, what is Dera? What is what happened to Dera guy? The baby is rich. They are up there. We are down here. Now me and you dead down here. Paul. Dara is different. Dara does not care about all these rich and poor stuff now. She likes me for who I am. You're the one saying this. Dara is different. Forgetting that Dara is not just one person. The gay papa. The gay family. What about society? I'm just looking out for you, bro. Paul. <laughs> You know, music and Dara are the two most important things in my life right now. Thank God. Praise the Lord. At least you even remember the music. But Dara now should be out of it. It's, it's supposed to be music and our studies. I love Dara. Love. More than love without money. Really? You want to Papa that one? Love. He love. I love Dara. I'm working on myself, bro. What do you mean? You're working on yourself. I'm you're losing focus, bro. I know what I'm saying. You're losing focus. That's why I'm complaining. This complaint, I'm complaining. I don't want you to get out at the end of this whole thing. Eh? We think this thing. I don't hear you. We think I'm. I'm serious. I'll be careful, bro. Okay. Well, let's jump right back now. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Wow. I'm good. Wow. That would be good. Yeah, bro. We did, baby, baby. Yeah. Now you they sing the song, man. I mean, no, no vex. <laughs> baby, baby. Mm -hmm. You they drive me so crazy, lady, lady. I know one day. Just repeat that beat. Go put that more. I'll be matching now. No more grandma. No more grandma again. All right, let me check it I still can't believe you convinced me to go on a walk instead of a fancy dinner. <laughs> so much. Well. Why we stand indoors when we can enjoy this view? Besides, I think you've had enough of fancy. Sometimes mm. simple is better. Oh, really? How cheesy. So, Mr. Musician, is this a part where you tell me you've written a song about me? <laughs> Actually, yeah. But it's not finished, though. Oh, I'd love to share with you. So, you're serious? Ah, oh, stop. So I'd love to hear it, can I? Should I teach mathematics, science, or theater? So many girls, but I still choose there. Gigi, stop! Because of me, I'm not a good one. I'm 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 a good one. Stop. No one has ever done this for me, Brian. I sounded nice. I meant everything I said, though. And um, even though we're from different worlds, I still want to get to know you better. The real you. You know me more than most people do. I love to know you better, Brian. 
Ah, uh, but let's take it one day at a time. No pressure. Just us. <laughs> I like that idea. Dad. How are you? I'm alright. My princess? How <laughs> you doing this morning? I'm okay. You are in a bright mood today. Mm? Hmm. Mm. I'm just happy. Can't I be happy, Dad? Of course, yes, you can be happy. But um, this is a different kind of happiness. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Hmm. You see, my dear wife is glowing now. Can you tell me what's making you so cheerful? Um, maybe I'm just excited about the weekend, or maybe I'm really grateful to have the best dad in the entire world. <laughs> Flattery can get you <laughs> everywhere. But I know you too well. Hmm? Yeah. Wow. You have something more. Come on, spill it. Sometimes good things are worth waiting for. I'll tell you in time, trust me. Yeah. All right, I will be patient. Huh? But remember, not a pity for too long from this your old man. We'll see about that, Dad. <laughs> we'll see about that. I love you, my baby. Oh, love. <laughs> <laughs> there. I need to say this again. Have you really thought this through? That was true. This whole you and Brian situation. Are you really sure about it? Are you sure about Brian? Chiji, we've talked about this. I like him. He likes me too. What's there to think about? You don't get it, do you? It's not just about liking each other. Brian is from a middle class family. His life, his struggle, they're different. You, you've grown up with almost everything you've ever wanted. But for him, it's just there. <laughs> his life, his struggle, it's different. There are, and relationships like this are always hard. It's going to be difficult for you, Dara. Chichi, I'm not a child. Okay. I can make my decisions by myself. My dad doesn't get to choose who I be with. And also, you underestimate Brian. He's going to be someone with or without my dad's approval. <sighs> Dara. I care about you, that's why I'm concerned. I don't want you to get hurt. I know how things like this play out and... Okay, it's fine. If you believe in him and you love him this much, then you have my 100% support. I mean, who am I? Thank you, Chichi. I'm fine. I'm okay. He makes me happy. I'm right. good. Just be happy. I'm okay. That's the only thing I care about. I don't want to see you get hurt. I'm good. Be happy and always keep that smile on your face. Yeah, I'm okay. Alright. Alright, I love you. I love you too. Hi, Mom. Hi, little son. You're welcome. How are you doing? I was school today. I'm fine. School was cool. Oh. Just there. But guess what? What's that? Finally talked to Dara about introducing her to you. Son, I'm worried. I'm worried about? You have mentioned this name, Dara, before. Are you sure about her? Mom, Dara is different. Dara is kind. Dara is smart. And Dara doesn't care about this rich and poor stuff. She likes me for who I am, and I knew it. Son, there is something I want to tell you about your father. What about him? He wasn't like this before. Your father came to our village 
for his NYSA. He was young, charming. We fell in love. I was young and naive. But when I got pregnant with you, he changed. He denied. Your father denied to you. He left. He never turned back. I heard he got married to the daughter of one very wealthy man. He never turned back. He never asked about us. I miss you all alone since then. I'm sorry I had to go through that one. If I'm not like my father, neither is Tara. And she's not going to leave me just because things are getting tough. I believe you. I did. But you have to promise me one thing. Anything, Mom. to be careful and guide your heart. I don't want you to pass through what I did. I promise, Mom. I'm going to be happy and I also need you to be happy. You deserve all the happiness in this world. You too, Mom. Remember that always, that your mother loves you. Um, Dad, I know you find this hard to accept, but I'm in love with Brian. Brian? That middle class boy. Have you forgotten who you are? I I thought you were just friends. What is all this madness, Dira? What is all this madness? Dad, Brian is not just some boy. He's kind, smart, and talented. His background shouldn't define what he is or who he is. Kind? Smart? Talented? <laughs> Those are just words. You think love is enough? Let me remind you of something. Your mother. The woman who promised me love and forever left us. Did you know why? Because I wasn't rich enough for her. Dad, Brian is not mom. Neither am I. He, he believes in me. He doesn't, he doesn't care about money. Believes in you? What about the life I have worked so hard to give you? Do you think love will pay the bills? Do you think his talent will give you the kind of life that you deserve? Dad, why his music is his passion? And I, I believe in him. One day his, his music would go far, Dad. I see potential in him, Dad. Potential? When have you ever heard of a poor musician making it big? Dira, don't be naive. Love will not fill your stomach when the time gets hard. I will improve of this. I have a friend. His son is studying law at Cambridge. When he returns, I want you to meet him. That is the kind of a man I want you to be with. 
someone who can keep the family legacy strong. Dad, you can't pick who I love. Pride makes me happy. Isn't that what you ever wanted? Happiness. <laughs> Your mommy promised me happiness too. And Cindy said, we built life together forever. But where is she now? Married to a rich man. <laughs> Perhaps it's not even in this country anymore. That is what love gave me. There are nothing but what? Heartache. Dad, I'm not mom. Neither is Brian. I, I believe in him. I just, I just wish you could trust me on this, Dad. I can't trust. Not this time. I have given you everything. But I cannot give you my blessing. I'm sorry. Dad. Dira. 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 Obviously, lose. Chai, I'm not even worried about the test. I mean, I've got the smartest girl in school for me to study. Mm. Oh, that won't save you. Well, I'll take it. Oh, no, 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 no. Mm. Okay. I do now, bro. I, I decide now. Who, who is this? Oh, sorry. My manners. This is Dara. Oh, she's how are you doing? Class, Maybe it's Dara. Oh, okay. Sorry, can I, can I see you? Like? Let me just let me holler at my bro. Huh? Okay, let me know. Okay, no. A day. Oh, who is that one? We don't start, guy. This is when? Which one is there, Anna? I don't understand my dad. He's being so unreasonable. Just because Brian doesn't come from money, he feels it's not good enough for me. There, I understand. I know it's tough when the people we love don't see what we see. But you have to understand that it's not just about the money. It's the fear of seeing you get hurt. I know, but it's unfair. Why does everyone judge Brian based on his background? It feels like I'm fighting alone. Dara, you are not alone. You've been here for me through everything. And if you and Brian cares about each other, then I'm here for you too. Everyone just, it just feels like everyone is against us, including Paul. Paul's always scared about what might happen. You have to understand that. People are always going to have their own opinions. But at the end of the day, it's your life. And if you and Brian are serious about each other, then I'm here for you. All the way, I'm not going anywhere. Thanks, G. I don't know what I'll do without you. And you don't have to find out. We just have to handle this whole thing. Because it's getting to me too. I don't like seeing you like this. We'll make them see. And if they don't see, we just have to show them that love is not just about money or background. <laughs> So what's in your heart? Oh my god. She'll be happy for me, okay? Thank you. I love you. I love you. Oh! Hello! Good evening, sir. Yeah. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Uh, have we met before? <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't think so. But <sighs> you never can tell. <laughs> this is a small, a small world. Mm. Yeah. Are you headed to my direction? Oh, of course, yes. You know. <laughs> okay. yeah. I, I, I'm just thinking maybe we have crossed paths before um, some of those um, you know, school events. You know, my daughter is in university now. And okay, so I, I have had the first shot of those. <laughs> Talk about that. My son is also in university. Mm. Eh, maybe. We have met at one of the parents' gatherings. Mm -hmm. You know, same faces yeah. after a while. <laughs> uh, you know, being a single parent, you know, it's all this work, you know, home, and, you know, uh, Try to be both parents, father and mother, you know. <laughs> I understand what you mean. Yeah. You know, it's a constant jungle. Yeah. We 
have to give them our best, yeah. don't we? Oh, of course, <laughs> yes, we do. You know, but it's not easy, you know. Um, you know, being um, parents and both father and mother, you know, like that, you know. So, you know. Really? It's not easy. Yes. Really. <laughs> but my son, my son is my everything and I want the best for him. Oh. Mm. Also, my daughter too, you know, I also want the best for her. <laughs> She's my world. <laughs> that's great. That's great. That's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I believe maybe our paths will cross officially. Mm, yeah, I did like that, you know. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hi, Mom. Thanks for you. You're welcome. How are you? Fine. Oh, Mom, this is Dara. Yeah, I've been telling you about. Good afternoon, Ma. It's nice to finally meet you. Good afternoon, dear. You're welcome, Tawa. Yeah, sit down. Um, so mom, uh, Dara has been looking forward to seeing you. She has been asking me every day, actually. Nice to hear that. Um, I also told Dara that you make the best jollof of rice in the world. And, but she was not convinced. Probably when she tasted it. Ma, I've heard a lot about your cooking and I'd really love to try it someday. I'm happy you like food. Brian here has talked a lot about it. But I hope you understand that our world is different from yours. Ma, I understand your concern, but I care about Brian a lot. I don't care about where he's from. I care about him for who he is. He's such an amazing person, and I really love the fact that he's in my life. Brian. Yes, ma'am. I don't want you to go through what I did. I don't want you to get hot like I did with your father. Mom, you raised me to be strong. I need you to trust me because I trust her. It's okay. I'll trust you on this, but you need to be careful. Thank you, Mom. Love is a beautiful thing, but it can also hurt. Yes, so you have to be careful. No. Okay, it's okay. Now let me go start on the channel of rice. Before <laughs> Brian oversells it, I'll be back. I trust you. <laughs> things about my past that I have never shared with you. I wanted to protect you. To give you the best life possible without burdening you with my pain. Daddy, you know I'm always here for you and you can tell me anything. Your mother, she was my world when we were young. We dreamt of building life together, of facing the world hand in hand. But when things got tough, When money became a problem, she left. She left because we were poor? Yes. She chose a richer man. Someone who could offer her a lifestyle. I couldn't at that time. I, I was devastated. And I promised myself I would never allow anyone to hurt me like that again. And I swore 
to protect you from the same pain. Dad, I'm sorry you had to go through all that. But Brian, Brian, he, he's not like that. What I see in him, it's, it's real. What I feel for him, it's real. He's kind. He's talented. Dad, he makes me happy. Yeah. As much as I love you, Dad, I'm also in love with Brian. Dara, you don't understand. People change when they are desperate. I can't allow you to throw your future on someone who might not be dead when things get tough. Please. Promise me you will stay away from him. Dad, I can't make such promises. I, I can't walk away from someone I love just because of what might happen. Dad, I believe in Brian the same way you believe in mom. Vera, I can't force you. But please, think about it. I am giving you time to come back to your senses. This is not the part I want you to take. I'll try and think about it, Dad. But you also have to understand me too. Brian, Brian is not just some boy. He's not just some random boy. He's, he's someone that makes me feel alive, Dad. Girl. I don't just want to lose you. Like I lost her. Trust me, Dad. I'm still here. You won't lose me. First is just there, boring as usual. These two just left me, I guess. Wait, I believe this too. They think they are Romeo and Juliet. Right. Well, you know, I've never seen Brian this happy before. He's just so head over heels. No doubt. Trust me, no doubt. I think there is his muse. Hmm. And you, Mr. Practical. What do you think of all of this? Like. What do you think of this whole thing? Like, what's the take on love? Uh, I want to know. Tell me. Love, 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 love. I would say love is not for me, though. Why? Well, it's great. It's not like it's not. Okay. It's, it is great. But as long as it doesn't make you lose focus or make you mess, mess up your head or something, I'm good. But there has always been guarded with our hearts ever since we met Ryan. I feel like there is this part of herself that that she just found. But then I can't help but worry though. You know, mixing two different words like this is not always easy. Yeah, I know. But maybe that's what makes it real though. Hmm. That's whether it's determined if they could like stand the test of time. I don't know. No, you could be this deep. And yeah, I was thinking you're just this friend that I write to David with Brian. Yeah. I have my moments, I guess. And my layers too. I guess. And you, you're not just there as wing woman, right? Okay. <laughs> I think there's still a lot of surprises. Lots of, right? Yeah. You look good, by the way. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Let's catch up with them. Let's just walk quickly. Okay. Dira. Dira. Why can't you just be happy for me, Dad? 
Why did you always have to be your way or nothing? I think I want to be this way. You think I enjoyed being a bad guy? I have seen when you let down your guard. Dira, I watched your mommy walk away from me because I wasn't good enough. I wanted to go through that kind of pain. I have seen how cruel people can be when they have nothing to lose. That what if you are wrong? <sighs> what if Brian is different? You're just judging him without even getting to know him. Dira, I don't want to see you get hurt. I can't go through that kind of pain. I can't lose you. You won't lose me. Trust me. Let, let me figure this out on my own, Dad. I promise you, Dad. You won't lose me. Dad. Good now. Yeah, I'm worried though. Worried about? Still, this there thing. This thing they disturb me for head. Yeah. Oh, what the? This laugh that you're laughing, seriously. Who is this guy? That it's the same thing I've been singing to you since now. Guy, I've said this thing over and over and over and over again. This guy is from your beach home. I don't see these things for movie. I don't see. I don't read them for book. I know what I'm saying. So what happened to Dara? What happened to Dara? Really? What happened to her? Guy, Dara is from a rich home. You guys are world apart. Okay. I've even I've even thought. What if what if will our father even accept you? Will our father even accept you? You don't even calm down, sit down, think that one. Paul. Terra is different, and I don't tell you this thing before. We've been through thick and thin together, and we're still standing now. But at what cost? At what cost? That's the point. This guy is, this guy is derailing you from your, from your focus, which is the music. You know, the, you know, you think about this music again, we don't push you since. Every time it's there, 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 there. Paul, my music and my dreams. They all make meaning because of her. Terra is my muse. I won't they, I won't they advise this boy again. I won't they advise you again. If they advise person with the love. But you know love is not enough, Abby. I don't know if you advise you again, I swear. For this matter, I don't know if you take again. Look me and you. Terra is your muse. So it's sweet for your mouth. I see you pack one kind of bears outside. We we go easy impress it, Papa. Soon, 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 soon. Soon. Are you gonna believe in me? I'll, I'll be there, Papa. Now. You don't believe in me. I believe in you. The music will be the singing. Eh, uh, now music. Music like we eat feed up. Okay. Uh, this matter. Tell me are you again. I'm gonna talk about something else again. Hey, Chichi, how are you? Yeah, please sit down. Yeah, I... I know you and Dara are close. Please. I want you to help me talk to Dara, okay? Uncle Steve, I understand that you're worried. But Dara is smart. She knows what she's doing. She's not just some naive girl. See, Chichi. She's too young to understand what is at stake. She's my daughter. My job is to protect her from making mistakes that could ruin her life. Sir Steve, I think you're underestimating the fact that Dara cares a lot about Brian and how much this could hurt her if she tries to separate them. I've seen the way the two of them love each other and Dara is really happy. 
and I've never seen her this way before. Chichi, so, I have sacrificed so much to see her. Settle for anything less than what she deserves. If you really care about her, you will help me to talk to her, please. I care a lot about Dara. And I'm going to be very honest with you. If you keep pushing her, you're just going to lose her. Understand this whole situation between you and your dad. But you have to follow your heart. Don't let anyone, not even your dad, dictate who you're going to love. I understand, Chi, but like, my dad has been through so much. And I don't want to hurt him. But at the same time, I can't control how I feel about Brian. I understand. Love is not always easy. But it's worth fighting for. Remember that guy I told you last year? That people didn't want me today because they thought it wasn't good enough for me. <laughs> yeah. They said it was never going to work out. But I did anyway. I dated him, even if it didn't last. But I didn't regret what I did because I followed my heart. I did what I did and I learned a lot from it. So I'm just trying to say that you should follow your heart, Dara. I know, I know. What if my dad never accepts Brian? What if I have to choose between the both of them? Dara, you don't have to choose. Come in. Dara. Your dad loves you a lot, you know, right? And he's just scared. He's just scared because of how things ended up between your mom and him. You just have to show him that you are not like your mother. And Brian is not like your mother as well. Well, your dad told me to convince you to stop loving Brian. He really told you to do that? Uh, yep. But I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I couldn't lie to you. I like what you and Brian share and I can't be the one to ruin it. I don't want to because I like you happy. I like seeing you happy. And that's what I'm telling you right now, that I'm not going to do it. If Brian make you happy, go for it. I don't mind. I'm always here with you. Yeah. I just want to see you happy. You're yeah, right, Chichi. I'm going to prove to my dad that me and Brian are meant to be. That's the spirit, baby. That's <laughs> the spirit. We just have to get your dad on board. That's it. Don't worry, be fine, okay? Come here. <laughs> Don't be fine. I love it, Bro, so you have no business being here. You are not good enough for my daughter. I want you to leave my house, and I never want to see you again near Dira. Okay? So please, I love Dara. I'm not here because of your world or your status. I'm here because I care about Dara more than anything in this world. And I know I may not have much, but I'm working out of myself. I have been. And I'm promising you. I'm going to take care of Dara. I'm going to give her everything she needs. Everything she deserves. What do you know about love? You will never be enough for my daughter. My daughter deserves the best. And you. You are just a distraction. A burden. If you really care about Dira, you will walk away now before you drag her down with you. Stop, please. Don't tell me to walk away from the person I truly love. From the person that I love. Leave now. I said leave now. I won't give up on her. I'll prove you wrong. Bro. 
Bro, I don't finally get them. Get waiting again. This is it. This is it. Which kind hit that one? I don't finally write song. We will change our life. Change life. <laughs> oh more. It don't start again. So I, I never see you like you this. Yeah, we want yam. We want yam. We want yam. Drop now. Drop. Uh, listen, listen. I don't want to spend time with more this girl. She they give me tough time. I need the two of her, but if I do, it will be important. She don't they do fuck up, fuck up. Mm, I just lock up, lock up. When you come back, you try to they give me the ginger. Hey, <laughs> Matt. I said I don't even really think beats. I don't. I just need to put it out there. Fire, fire. I have to go to that studio and record it. Ah. As you're just singing now, eh? I was just seeing David Do. Try. Whiskey. Mm -hmm. Bonner Boy. Mm -hmm. I swear, you don't blow. Adrema, Adrema. My Adrema. Adrema. Banga. <laughs> eh! Wow! I, I just need to put it out there. I just need to go to the studio and record it. We change our life. Maybe. Mr. Steve. You don't see me as well. Yeah, you don't come again with this, Mr. Steve. Ah, we all know you got talent, guy. If not talent, we deliver leave for you. I come up with you. We all know you got this thing. So forget about this, Mr. Steve. If this man is see what they see. Now he lost. Now he, now he lose. No be. Ah, but this song. No. I to enter studio. I to enter studio. I to enter studio. Ah. Guy, this song will blow. Not saying but won't tell me. This song will blow. Or like. This song will blow. I go make up. You, my mom, bro, I'm for Dera. Eh, Dera, sha. <laughs> we'll leave that one first, bro. <laughs> ah, no, 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 no. Guy, guy. We'll go studio. Prepare, prepare, prepare. We'll go studio, I beg. You know, Betty, I thought raising the child was the hardest part. Uh, the real part is put them in the right part. <laughs> Still, you're right. You know, children of these days, they have the mind of their own. Like my son, he's stubborn as the day comes. But I've learned one thing. I've learned that pushing them too hard makes them to push more harder back. So. We allow them to make their choice. <laughs> okay, Betty. Uh, you see, stubborn does not even describe my day. I suppose you are right. But it's not easy. Especially when you know that the world is, you know, is a kind. In my day, she's my princess, my only child. And she is so full of life and determined. Uh, I'm worried. I'm worried about she's going to get hot like I did. No. You know, Steve, we don't have to shield and protect them as we wanted to. Mm. Pains and happiness are part of life, part of growing, like myself. My son cut a big tree. But you know, the world is not always kind to dreamers. It's funny, isn't it? Yeah. But it's not easy. And here we are. You know, different lives, different worries, and different problems. But the same worries. <laughs> you know, and I guess it's just a part of the parents, uh, you know, worries, trying you know, to do their best. But we just have to trust that they will find their way. Maybe, maybe they will surprise us one day. <laughs> yeah. You know, I just want her to be happy, but also safe. Is that too much to ask? No, <laughs> it's not. But you know, in life, mm. happiness and safety mm. don't work hand in hand. <laughs> you understand? Yeah. So, in this case, we have to give them 
fair chance and believe that they will make the right ones. Mm. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah. Is this your son? Yes. That's my son, Maya. What do you ask? This is the boy I have been telling to stay away from my own daughter. You mean <laughs> to tell me? It's Brian. <laughs> Steve, wait, wait. <laughs> wait. Is your daughter Dara? <sighs> no. Oh. My son has not mentioned Dara's last name. But you spoke so much about him with so much admiration. <sighs> Betty. Yes. I am not worried about this. I have been telling your son to stay away from my daughter, Dira. She's my only child. And I want the best for her. Brian, that is not in our world. And there is so much at stake here. I know where you're coming from, Steve. But Ray and my son is a good boy. We may not have much now, but my son is driven, talented. He truly cares about Dara. Just the way you want the best for your daughter. That is the way I want the best for my son, too. Betty, I have seen how the world can tear people apart over things like this. Dearest mother, walk away because I didn't have enough. And I don't want that kind of heartbreak for my daughter. I've been hot still, Steve. But let us not let our past dictate their future. Maybe, maybe we should be civil for their sake. Let them figure out things without our fears holding them back. <sighs> for their sake, Betty, I will try. But. Yes. I will stand by, seeing my daughter get hurt. And I won't watch my son get hurt too. They are young. Maybe they will surprise us. Oh. Let's see how this play out. <laughs> Thanks, Betty. Okay, thanks for coming around. Yeah. To take care of yourself. So, Mr. Music Producer, are you going to let Brian into the studio? Or are you planning to just make him do all the assignments? You know, thinking about it now, I think I have to make Brian start paying for all I do for him. Why? What is why? Do you know the workload uh, I do for that guy? Okay. You, <laughs> you, should, you don't want to know, trust me, you don't want to know. All right. But then, look at us being the reasonable ones. Who could have known? I would not want you to get used to it, though. Uh, and I still intend to be the phone one, so. OK. Mm -hmm. But then, do you think we should allow them fix this whole thing by themselves? Or we should keep playing the little cupid? Well, now you're asking me. A little numb here and there won't hurt, though, right? Mm -hmm. And besides, who is to help them if not us? So. Just promise you won't make it worse, Mr. Cupid. How would I make things worse? Just saying. Okay, I promise. Okay? Okay. Mrs. Music Maker, I promise. <laughs> okay? 
Thanks for bothering me now. Please. Okay. Okay. Thank okay. you. My princess. How did you get here? You know, children of these days, they have a mind of their own. Like my son, he's stubborn as the day comes. But I've learned one thing. I've learned that pushing them too hard makes them to push more harder back. So we allow them to make their choice. <laughs> It's my own fear talking. I need to trust her. She is strong. Stronger than I was. And if she believes in him, maybe need to believe in her. I just want you to be happy, Dora. Maybe... Maybe Brown is the one that can do that. Betty. Yes, dear. I have been thinking about you. About us, actually. Steve. Yes. This feels strange. Our kids, they are in love. Betty. Yes, sir. Maybe we are just two people through a lot. But now, we have found something good in each other. Maybe it's actually what we need. Steve. Yes. What about our children? This will make everything complicated for them. But Steve, you make me happy. Yes. You make me happy, but I'm scared. No. We'll take it one step at a time. But don't just shut me out. Yeah. One step at a time. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. Thank you. <sighs> mm. Oh, you take my leave. It's okay. You're welcome. Um, Brian, I've been thinking a lot lately about me, you, us, and everything that's been going on lately. It's Dara. 
Hey. You mean the world to me. Ryan, honestly, I've never felt like this for anyone before. You make me feel like myself. And anytime I'm with you, it feels like I'm home. Girl. You mean everything to me. I don't care about the differences or the challenges. All I care about is that I'm always happy when I'm with you. I love you, Brian. I really do. I love you, Dara. More than anything in this world. <laughs> I guess there's no turning back now, huh? <laughs> no turning back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, <laughs> yeah. I really enjoyed myself this night. Mm. Actually, it's been a while I feel this at ease. But uh, I'm glad you did. I enjoyed more than expected. Mm. Okay, honestly. But Betty. <clears throat> I have been thinking about something. Our kids. Us. But I don't know where this is going. I I just feel something is good. Steve, you make me feel happy. Yeah? Really? I feel right. You feel right? Yes. Yeah. I think yeah. those are good feelings, mm. doesn't it? Of course, yes, I feel it too. <laughs> <laughs> it going? Thank you, sir, for asking. Well, I've been attending some studio sessions and it's quite challenging though, but mm. I'm excited about what I meet you. Cool. It's being mother's dad. His songs are amazing. I'm sure mm. he's going to be the next big thing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there, I thank you being a bit biased. But I've heard some of his music. And I can only say, I'm proud of you, son. Thank you, Mom. You're welcome. Thank you for all the support to you. You're everly welcome. You know, Brian, I can't wait for you to perform. I'm sure the crowd is going to sing a lot to all <laughs> your songs. As long as we're there. Oh, stop. You know, sometimes life has a way of surprising you. And you think you actually know how it's going to turn out. But then, 
something unexpected happens. <laughs> Life is full of surprises. But sometimes, the surprise turns out to be the best thing ever happened to us. But Brian, I can't believe you actually convinced Mr. Steve to like you. Hey, I was thinking you'd be needing a miracle. Well, it was not a miracle. I don't think it was a miracle. I guess I just convinced him that I was in love with her. And I knew you. Okay, this guy. So what you're trying to say now is you're practically now in the clear with the almighty Mr. Steven. Hmm. Or do you still need to like start in a gladiator match or something? <laughs> <laughs> Should see this guy back there. Hmm. Uh, if it was to be a gladiator match, I could not lose. <laughs> True. Real. But honestly, Mr. Steve has been pretty cool lately. Yeah. Yeah, he has been really supportive and he has been asking Brian about his music. Huh. Really? <laughs> sure, cool. But then, seeing the two of you together and with the way Mr. Steve's been coming around, I think this can actually work. This is going to work out. And Paul and I might just end up being the supportive sidekick. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm right. Really? Yeah. Sidekick. Yeah. But well, guys, seeing that you both insisted on being happy and in love. They sound like fun. <laughs> ah, who's a fan? I'm not. Please. We I'm support not. you now. I'm not. We're just, uh, we're just, we're just, we're just supportive Watch friends. Cheers. Cheers to the biggest fan. Ah. And, <laughs> and cheers to Mr. Steve running after me again. <laughs> no, this guy is so fat. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Brian, that was amazing. Ah, my son, you really got good talent. I can't wait to hear it on the radio someday. I'm glad you like it. Man. Yes, I did. Warm up. Just a warm of us. I need to hear it. Then we'll go to bed, okay? Deal. All right. Okay. One more verse. You know we need to be sleeping. I am tired. I need to go and sleep. So please do the one more verse. Let's go and sleep. I'll be coming soon. When they rush me, I'll be done. I like making money, buying more money. I'm getting money. They call you with the phone for me. They call you one day. They pick up, I go show you shake. This is so tight, so wet, so clean. I stop all of my G. Wow, that is fantastic. This is good. It's okay. So, let us go. Sleep. Come on. Hmm? I can go now. Good night. Love you. Something they see. Mm. You've been happier than you draw. <laughs> What's going on? Is there something or someone that's making you this happy? You know, Dira. You know you're a smart girl. You know, always speaking on things. Let's say life has a way of surprising you when you less expected it. Wow. Yeah. Hey. So there's someone. Come on, Dad. Let's have it. Spill the beans. Who's this lucky lady? <laughs> Come on. 
Oh, well, uh, let me say I've just met somebody who uh, reminded me that uh, happiness is still possible. Oh. I knew it. Whoever this your new friend is, she's doing a great job. I love yeah. seeing you happy that you deserve it for real. Yeah. Um, Daddy. Yes. I've been meaning to ask. Mm. We're never in support of me and Brian being together. Not that I'm angry. I'm I'm glad you're in support now, but okay. I never really had the time to ask what changed. Uh, you know, at first I was just too scared. I didn't want you to pass through the same pain I did with your mother. But I realized it was unfair. But I saw that you care so much about Brian. And I had to trust you for that. Mm. Thank you, Dad. Yeah. I know that it must have been very, very difficult for you to accept. But I'm really, really glad you were able to accept. Brian, Brian is a good guy. Mm. He makes me happy. Just like your new friend makes you happy. <laughs> it's your new friend. Well, promise me you will stay true to yourself. No matter what happened out there. Love is important. And so, your future too. I promise that. I'm proud of you. <laughs> Thank you, Dad. Thank you. So, Chichi baby, what's going on between you and Paul? Because I feel you guys speak like bread and butter. Very good, there. Not Paul, please. Ha, I beg. <laughs> so you don't see it? <laughs> no, that one is too serious, I beg. You were all over him the last time I went to Brian's house, there. Everything about Paul is by the book, by the book. I don't feel I can't. <laughs> He's the first time oh. I've seen you rejecting a cute guy. Hey, it's not like I don't like cute guys or something, but Paul is just... He uh, can't even crack a joke. Oh, God. I can't, there are, but okay. then... Okay. You don't always need a comedian. You need someone serious in your life. Maybe you're the one that will bring him outside this chair. Okay. And you think it's Paul. Paul. He's already your friend and he has a good heart. There, I can't, I can't, I can't be with somebody that just have a good heart. I want someone that will crack a joke for me. Someone that will make me always smile. Someone that will do things for me. But Paul, Paul does that. I don't know. You see, let me tell you something. They always say the things you run away from are the things that you fall into. Uh -huh. Where did you hear that one? You fall into Paul. Where did you hear that one? I created the quote <laughs> myself. <laughs> Not Paul, there are no Paul. He's Paul. No Paul. Like See, it's not Paul. like Paul is bad, but yeah. at least call people like Michael. How about your Mr. Typo? You said you were sweet. Do you, why do you have to call him Mr. Typo? Mm -hmm. I hope he's great. There are. Your nursery school boyfriend. There are. Mm -hmm. Respect yourself. Mm -hmm. But then I like Michael. Mm -hmm. But Paul is not bad. Mm. But he just have to. He's, he has a lot of things to fix on himself, and I don't think I'm ready to do that for him. <sighs> I don't want to fix any guy. I want my own guy. I okay. want him complete. Mm. <sighs> mm -hmm. Is that exactly, boy? Man, kid, I want to follow. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm mm -hmm. happy don't talking you. about. Don't talk about Paul again. Do you? Ah, do you? Do Thank you. you. Mm. Steve. Yes. This field is wrong. I mean, what we're having is beautiful. But I can't stop thinking about Tara and Freya. How would they take it? What would this do to them? How are they going to take it if they find out? 
How would they feel? I understand better. I do. But life... Life is full of things that does not make sense at first. I know this is complicated. I know there is a risk that could hurt them. <sighs> maybe. Just maybe if they see how happy we are, they will understand. We deserve happiness too. Maybe this will bring us closer. In a way we never expected. You're right, Steve. Yes. Really. But if this thing didn't work out. I don't know. I don't know how to face my son. I can't even bear it. I don't, I, I can't stand it. We will make it work together. This is not happening. Not now. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. No. How do I begin to explain to Brian? Now that he's finally happy, finally moving with his life. Hey, no. It's going to change. It's going to change a lot of things. How do I start? Where, 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 where do I start? Where do I start from? Hey. Mm. Ah. Betsy. Betsy. How do I tell them? How do I face them? But I can't face this alone. I, I, I don't even know how Steve will react to this. No. <laughs> How do I pray? Hello, Steve. Oh, how are you? I'm fine. 
Thank you. Please sit down. How are you doing that time? Yeah. yeah, she's upstairs resting. She's okay. Steve. Yeah. We have to talk about everything. I haven't told Gray and my son. I'm terrified about how he's going to react. But you can't keep these secrets much longer. I know, Betty. I have been thinking about you too. But the thought of losing you and the baby is what I cannot bear. And also, I can't imagine how Dira would take it. She has been through so much because of me. Steve, we have to face this. We can't keep hiding. The longer we wait, the harder it is for both Dara and Preya to accept. What are you talking about, Dad? Dara. I, I... No, Dad. You don't get to eye your way out of this. You've been lecturing me about how me and Brian are wrong for each other because of where he's from and for who he is. And all this time, you've been with her. I, I, I can explain. Explain you. what exactly? Explain what exactly that you're an hypocrite. That you've been lying all this time, that you're trying to protect me. That you judged me, that you judged Brian. And you've been with her. You are having a baby with her, Dad. The same woman you told me to stay away from her son. Deborah, we never meant to cut you. All this, all these things wasn't planned. But your father and I care so much about each other deeply. Yes, we're going to have a child. But that doesn't mean that we wanted to deceive you. No. I trusted you, Dad! I don't even know who you are anymore. I can't do this. Dira. Dira. Hi, Mom. How are you? You look so scared. Like you've seen a ghost. What happened? Brian. We... We need to talk. There is... Uh, there is something... You need to... What is it, Mom? I've been seeing someone for a while now. I don't know how to tell you this. Who? I, 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 I am pregnant. Pregnant? Oh, almost top job. For who? Steve, the last father. Mr. Steve? 
how 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 did this happen? How how could you? It didn't just happen with with the planet. It just it, it, it just happened, and I don't know how to tell you because I was scared. I don't know how you react to it. How could you know? You are pregnant with the child of the person that has been keeping me away from his daughter. See, it's hard to believe, but Steve is changing. He is softening. And I care much about him. See, the baby is a blessing no matter how it feels complicated right now. Mom, where does that leave me? Where does that leave us? This changes everything. It doesn't change that I still love you. It doesn't change that you're still my son. It can never change anything. You are my son. Please, you can trust me on this. Yes, we can work it out as a family. Please, just trust me. Mom, I don't know how we're going to do this. You know I love Dara. And now this. Oh, please. But you can't, you, you, you can just, you can trust me. I still can't believe they could do this to us. Your mom, my dad, and now she's having a baby. I know, right? I can't still believe they betrayed us like this. They've turned our world upside down. We're the ones supposed to be in love, not them. And, uh, but we can't let this break us. We're stronger than that. I love you more than anything. What if we fall apart? What if they fall us apart? Yeah. Nothing's going to let us fall apart. I don't want to lose you, Brian. You my everything, Brian. What? I promise. I love you so much. I love you too, Brian. Dira! 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 Oh. Hello, son. Brian! Brian! Brian!
Brian, please don't do this to me. Don't. Please don't do this to your mother. No. 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 Yeah, please pick. Just pick your call. Please, please, just... No. Hello? I can't find my son. Betty? My son is gone. What's wrong? His bag's not gone. I don't know what to do now. Please relax, okay? Relax. Don't worry. Eh? But, 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 if, if he, he, he's not around too. Yes. Eh, I'll be searching for her throughout. Yes, in the house, yes. What have you done? What have we done? We have driven them away. But I, I just want you to relax, okay? Don't panic, okay? We will find them. Just relax. Don't panic, okay? Relax, please. It's okay. Don't cry again. Don't cry again. <laughs> oh, I don't know what to do now. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. <laughs> I should have allowed this get to this far. What am I going to do now? We will find them, okay? We will find them. I'm promising you we will find them. We have to make things right before it's too late. We have to find them. It's okay, don't worry. We'll make sure we see them and we'll correct every mistakes that we have done, okay? All right? Is that right? I have to go right away to find them. If you hear anything, you let me know. I, I, yes, I, I, I have to go now. There are what's wrong. But yeah, for you, whatever you're going through, we'll help you get through it. Just talk to us, please. I don't like seeing you like this. Gigi, I don't even know where to start from. Our parents, they, they found everything apart. They ruined everything. Gigi, there's a baby on its way. What did they expect us to do? It's not looking like... They didn't even care about us. <laughs> All they cared about themselves, their past, their mistakes. Guys, I think Brian is right. But seriously, running away, running away isn't going to solve anything. Hiding out here is not going to bring down anything. Just let them. If hiding here would make everything feel better, then it's fine, just stay. I don't want you to make any decision out of fear or anger. Just take your time. Okay, we are here for you. We are your friends. And whatever you need, we are always here for you. There are... I don't just like seeing you guys like this. Please, stop crying. Chichi, honestly, I need speed. I, I need some time. Like, how do I settle things with parents? Like, then take your time. Some time. I need, I need you guys to promise me you won't tell our parents about this. We promise. Of course, of course. I promise, I won't. We promise, we promise. <laughs> okay? We are always here for you guys. Always. <laughs> Chichi and myself, we're always here. That Whenever you okay. need us, we're here. It's okay, Brian. It's okay. <laughs> 
Thank you. <laughs> it's okay, Dara. It's okay. <laughs> please, please, did you did you see my son? I you didn't see him. He's fair. He's fair. Please, yes, I'm looking for her. Yes, it's very urgent. Please, y yes, yes. Oh, I'm looking for her. What happened? Out. No, 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 no. Where is he? Don't worry. Is he coming from? Please, did you see this girl? Please, did you see this girl? You don't see? You don't see? Please, please. Look at her. She, 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 she really looked like me, please. Did you see her? You don't see her? Ah, you don't see her? Ah. I think I can do this. What do you mean? <laughs> I let my mom about the pregnancy. She has been through a lot for me. And sacrificed a lot for me. You, Brian. I can't lose you, Brian. Brian, what are you saying? We made promises, Brian. Brian, please. I love you, Tadira. No. But look how it's doing to our parents. They cost it upon themselves. What are you saying, Brian? They are out there. Scared and hurting. So we aren't hurting, is that what you say? I don't want to give them. I don't want to see them in pain. So you won't see me in pain then? Pram, please. Why do we have to sacrifice everything for them? Pran, I love you. 
Brian, it's not our fault our parents are in love, Brian. We just wanted to be happy, Brian, please. Brian, what are you saying, Brian? I know there. You don't. <laughs> but sometimes, loving someone or someone is letting them go. I don't want you to let me go. Brian, please, I don't want to lose you. I don't know how to give up, Brian, please. <laughs> Brian, please. But maybe in the next life. No, what are you talking about in the next life? Brian, I want you now. What are you saying? Maybe in the next life. Brian, don't say the next life. Brian, please. You find out what Brian, I don't want to lose you. What are you saying, Brian? Brian, please don't stay with me, Brian. Brian, Brian, you're hurting me, please. Brian, we made promises. What are you saying, Brian? Brian, you're breaking my heart. <laughs> Stop. Brian, please, you promise, Brian. Brian, please, everything, Brian. Please look at me, Brian. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> so so what so what you're giving up now right like i guess this is goodbye then <laughs> no stop Why don't you stay goodbye then no brian stop Brian, stop, please, please, Brian, please, you made promise, Brian, please, you said you would leave me, Brian, please stop, Brian, please, please, please don't leave me, Brian, please don't leave me, Brian, Brian you promised, stop, don't tell me, Brian, no, Brian, stay, please, Brian, stop, why you promised me? Why you promised me? Oh! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I have been so blinded by my fears. I, I, I couldn't see what I was doing to you. I, I never meant to hurt you like this. I, I was, I was, I was so scared, scared of losing you, of you making the same mistake I did, but 
I see you go. I see. I'll see you go away. Dad, I want you to be with Betty. I want you to be happy. So, me and Brian, we've, we've decided to let you guys be together. We don't want to be the reason why you guys can't be happy. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for everything. I never meant to haunt you. I, 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 I just, I just wanted you safe for me, please, please. It's okay, Dad. Please, I'm sorry. We'll figure it out. I always do. Thank you. I appreciate you, and I love you too. I I need to talk to you about something very important. I know you are happy with Brian. And I'm glad, you know, you are finding your way. Just remember, your studies comes first. I still want you to maintain your grades and focus on your future. I understand that, but Brian, he, he supports my goals and he keeps me right on track. You don't have to worry about anything. I'm still committed to making you proud. All right, I trust you. Just keep doing your best. We'll go through together. Ah, uh, Dad. Yeah. How about we celebrate my commitment to that famous chocolate cake you always prepare? <laughs> you always know how to get what you want. <laughs> you don't worry, I'll get the cake ready, okay? <laughs> Dad, yeah. thanks for always being my best supporter. Mm. Always, baby, always, always. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. So, does anyone need anything else? No. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, because um, we've got a big day ahead of us. And then uh, I'm taking you all out for shopping, huh? Mm -hmm. And if you want anything, it's on me. Thanks, Dad. Thank that you, Dad. That great. So, Mom. How's the baby doing? Baby is fine. Baby has been kicking a lot lately. But it's fine. Brian here kicked even more when he was in here. <laughs> um, I mean, as if I was practicing my football skills there. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it has been a rough road, but here we are together. That's what matters. Yes. Yeah. Together, that is the key word there. Yeah. That is all I have wanted for us to be together. <laughs> love you. I love them. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> I love you both. Enjoy yourself. Mm -hmm. Enjoy yourself, okay? I'm just gonna have to make it. Take my breath away. Make the same mistake. Take my breath.